This is the Zoll AED3 Automated External Defibrillator. Install the battery into the back lower section of the AED. The battery cartridge is keyed and can only be installed one way. Make sure you hear a click, which indicates the battery is completely seated in the AED. This will immediately initiate a battery insertion test. Successful completion of the battery insertion will be indicated with a voice prompt of Unit OK and a check mark in the indicator on the top left of the AED. Take the cable connector from the pad package and plug in firmly. The electrodes have a rescue kit attached to it. Place the pads in the pads holder on the back of the AED with the shears facing in. The setup is now complete. Now let's see how to use the unit in case of emergency. To turn on, press the power button. This AED has a built-in feature that allows it to be placed standing up for easy access. Remove the pad package from the back of the unit. Open it to expose the electrodes. Just follow the visual and voice instructions and carefully place the pads exactly as shown on the pictures on the patient's bare chest. The AED's integrated real-time feedback eliminates guesswork. It provides rescuers with visual and audio prompts. Please visit our website to learn more about our products and services.